Welcome to all of our first-time guests. We are honored that you are worshiping with us, whether in person or online. If this is your first visit, please let us know by going to www.newcov.org, clicking the Connect button, and then selecting Connect as a Visitor. There you will view a short message from our pastors and give us brief contact information. We will only use that info to send you a personal thank you for being with us. With all the places you could worship, we are blessed that you chose New Covenant and we hope you will come again. The summer session of small groups will begin on June 20th. Invite your family, friends, and neighbors to join you and choose from groups that fit a variety of schedules and discussion topics related to strengthening your foundation of the word. To get information, find a group, and to register, go to newcub.org and click the Small Groups button on the homepage. Let's connect, fellowship, grow, and do life together. It's time. It's time. It's time. It's time. It's time. We babies are having a crisis. Babies aren't getting as much love as we used to. It's time. Time to walk it like you talk it. New Cub is putting you on notice. And because he is now the enlightened one, his job is to come and free those that are still trapped in the cave. It's time. It's time. It's, it's time. time. What happened? I'd like to bypass senseless debate altogether and jump to the conclusion which every sophomore is already aware of. There is no God. It's time to bring your gifts your talent, your brilliance, your genius. What? Where did this come from? It's time. We want to see the fifth Sunday, July youth and young adults lit. There's nothing more beautiful than the chance to share your love for Christ with dance or prayer, or song or poem. Your gifts are welcome here, so let your voice and talent fill the air. Contact Pam Gardner at pgardner at newcub.org. It's time. God took the strength of a mountain, the majesty of a tree, the warmth of a summer sun and the calm of a quiet sea, the generous soul of nature, the comforting arm of night, the wisdom of the ages, the power of the eagle's flight, the joy of a morning in spring, the faith of a mustard seed, the patience of eternity, the depth of a family need. Then God combined these qualities, and when there was nothing more to add, he knew his masterpiece was complete, and so he called him Dad. Happy Father's Day. And I'm grateful for the love to me you show. And you are my son, and as long.